Welcome back, folks, to the Hardcore Minecraft Let's Play. When we last left off, it was the middle of the night and it's raining. I'm waiting for it to become daytime so I can fence these chickens in. And when the chickens are fenced in, I can wait for the eggs. The eggs are what I want. I might try and bring a cow or two with me. When I go back home, it will be a very long trek if I decide to try and bring it. Hello, pig! You can't come in. You can't come in because this is my house. Only people wearing full suits of iron armor are allowed to live here. So I'd be sorry, pig. I can't lure the pig because I don't have a carrot. Oh, you're a skeleton. He can't get in, though. And it won't murder the cows. Wouldn't the mobs be so much more hostile if they just went around murdering everything? That would just be really, really horrendous. Like you spend all this time searching for chickens and then a zombie comes and just eats them. Which I have to say, the current system of zombie, like, aggro and hoarding, I've had major problems with that. Especially when I've been trying to make a village. Like, zombies spawn all over the place at night. And if you don't have an iron golem, how on earth are you meant to defend them? Like, I had a situation where I was fighting 11 of them at once. With two creepers there as well. Hello! How are you? Are you alright? What's that? Scared that it's going to become daytime and you're going to die? Well, hope for you that the rain doesn't settle. And if the rain set doesn't settle, you'll live! Until the rain does settle, when you'll die. A slow and painful death. I am getting quite hungry, though. Good thing I brought some mushroom stew with me. I don't wonder why the torches don't extinguish in the rain. Oh, that's a spider. Fortunately, I don't think he's aggressive to me because I'm hiding in this house. Actually, I don't think that's how aggression with the spiders works. I think it's aggressive to me anyway. Which is going to really suck when I'm going to have to fight it at dawn. Rain when it's daytime is absolutely fine, but rain when it's night just extends the amount of time that the creatures exist. Well, with creepers, that's not so bad, but skeletons and zombies, which normally burn up, yeah, it's pretty bad then. So, objective for the morning. We can put that compass away, because we're not going anywhere anytime soon. Objective for the morning. Make a coop for the chickens, start hoarding those eggs, and just explore the area around me. Treat it as if it's an area I've only just been to, only just spawned in. And see if I can get some semi-valuable resources. The reason why I'm not desperate to find a village right now is because... Oh good, the rain stopped just before dawn. Because when I have the sugar cane and can make potions of range potions of weakness and golden apples, I can make my own village. <laughs> well, to be perfectly honest, do I really want to? Could seal them off behind a steel door, an iron door, and just lock them up forever. It's becoming dawn. The sun is rising in the sky. Skeletons, time to die. It's not really much of a house, is it? There are my iron boots that I've not used. It's a cow. I thought that was a spider for a moment. Yeah, he's waiting for me. You're dead now. <laughs> Hello, mm -hmm. cow. Can I help you? No. What is it I can do for you, creature of the wild? You think about it. Come back to me when you know. Right, we have a few chickens. But chickens really aren't going to help me at this point. 
because I don't have a coop to put them in. Yet. Give me a little time and I'm going to fashion one. It will have the unintended side effect that creatures that fall from it, from above it, will get stuck. But I could deal with them as and when the situation arises. So there's one chicken. There's at least one. Is that a jungle biome? The jungle biome here too. And there's an egg. I should totally go to the jungle biome. See if I can get some jungle trees and some cocoa. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Cocoa as well, eh? We're turning into a turning into a regular decent uh, jaunt. We're gonna have to get cows now. There's cocoa here. We're gonna have to get cows. Yep. The main reason we're going to have to get cows now is so that I can uh, take advantage of the beloved Coco. So I have a few of them. The cow is seeking more of my wisdom. I'm currently a bit busy cow. You'll have to inquire at a later date. So, put that there, put that there, that there, that there, we need to, actually we don't need any more. Okay chickens, it's time to lure you into my coop. Come on chicken, they're a stickler for seeds, you'll follow me anywhere. Even into captivity. You're a bit stuck, aren't you, cow? <laughs> Magical cow acceleratortron. Chicken. Come on. In you come. In you. In. in you come. In. 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 I want to push you in them. You are now trapped. Ingenious. There was another chicken. I saw it. There it is. You, come this way. Come this way. Stop spinning. Stop spinning and come to captivity. It's alright. I'll let you go once I leave. I'm benevolent like that. There we go. And I'll eat some stew. <laughs> you know, there are a few cows here. There are cows closer to the exit now, aren't there? Right, I need to find some jungle trees, and I need to cut them down. Some vines wouldn't go on this, either. I already have vines. I don't need vines. See that big tree over there? Just there? I'm gonna make one of those. I'm gonna make one of those... I need four saplings. Though having more jungle saplings will be better in the long run. So I'm going to put down a fair few of these trees. You can also get uh, cats here. But I'm not going to get one of those yet. I know that heading straight south brings me to an island, so I can also make a map eventually. Um, you're not going to make anything awesome there, are you? I would like some saplings. Please? No pressure. I just wouldn't mind some. Well, this is going to give me a nice supply of wood. Always look at the positives. positives down into small chunks. Ah, oh, this is a tall tree. I 
hope it gives me some saplings. Hint, hint, game. I haven't found any yet. They're a bit stingy on giving you saplings in, uh... In this. They're a bit stingy. Is that one? No. That's not. I'll chop down the entire forest. That means that I actually get some saplings. I will deforest this thing. That's a normal sapling, isn't it? <sighs> Boo hiss. What do I throw away? Throw it that for now. I need to make a chest. Or else I'm not actually going to be able to store any of this cool stuff. I might just be leaving this here. Look, I don't need that one now. All that, all that, all that, all that. Hold on to that, but put it there. That egg is important, but not important as it is. And put that there. And put the cactus there. That's also going to be important later. But not super important right now. Back to the jungle. The jungle that is refusing to drop me any saplings. Jungle. Ah, jungle saplings! Two of them. And there was me just saying it didn't drop me any saplings at all. Ah, another one. That's three. Not done yet, though. Need a few more of these. Deforesting the jungle. <laughs> I won't deforest all of it. I never deforest all of it. You lose access to some pretty cool things if you deforest it all. Well, that's the end of that. Bought another one, though. That should hopefully provide me with all the saplings I need. Failing that to keep searching, but jungle saplings are cool. I'm definitely going to build a jungle tree. So those chickens will just start laying eggs. That's not a chicken. That's just, uh... It's just some sand. I'm seeing chickens everywhere. Definitely going to try and lure over some cows, though. Nothing to refill my, uh, bowl with, though. I'm gonna have to actually start mining, um, farming, aren't I? That's really gonna suck. But, you've gotta do what you've gotta do. And if you need to farm to survive, then you need to farm. Ah, cow got stuck. <laughs> well, looks like he's staying there for now, isn't he? I have the, uh, I have that. For now, I guess I'll farm little. Or a lot. I'm gonna need a lot of farming if I'm gonna survive here for any long period of time. Is there another sapling? It has not dropped one. I'm disappointed in you. You have to move on to another tree now. Hope you realize the ramifications of this. More trees have to die because you would not drop me what I want. And that was a sapling. Got another egg though. Definitely again there with the eggs. Some people would think that maybe getting like six or seven eggs is sufficient. Not true, I've actually thrown 15 eggs down once, and it didn't give me a single chicken. You only need one chicken, because once you have one, they just start laying more eggs, and then those... Ah, uh, no, that is not like a... That almost looked like one, but it's not. It's just not dropping one, is it? 
better quickly destroy this tree and get back into my hole. It's getting late. It's getting late and the last thing you want to be stuck in when it's late is outside. Being stuck outside when it's late in Minecraft can indeed be a death sentence. And often is. One last chance. Last chance to drop me what I want. You are very stubbornly refusing to drop what I want, aren't you? Great. Great. all these because I really would like some more seeds. Because I'm not going to be able to plant anything without seeds. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. Don't don't push your luck, Kakoskia. You don't push it. There's a villager zombie. Might as well go and fight him. That's what they look like. Ow. I'm gonna keep hiding now. While the zombies all swarm in. Fortunately, they can't do anything to hurt me. Instead, all they'll do is probably putter around and bang ineffectually on a wall, on a door. Ah, two eggs. And I brought my fishing rod with me. I should probably actually get enough. Ah. Fine. You wanna fight me? There. Is that worth it? No more from coming. Let them hammer on the door for a little while. And fight them. Yeah, this is what zombies do. You have a shovel. Can I have that? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm not dying to zombies. No, I'm not eating that. This, thank you. Give myself more room to back up. Oh god, this sword was. Oh! No! 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 I'm not dying! To zombies. No. That's not happening. It's not happening. I mean, they're going to keep coming. I should just make it a... I've clearly not learned, have I? No doors. Just a one high pile of dirt. 
One high pile of dirt is completely impenetrable. And that piece of experience is failing to flow into me. But that's okay. We nearly died, though. That was close. I was a little too close. That was very close. He dropped an iron bar, though. <laughs> Zombies have a very low chance of dropping those. So in effect, iron is a renewable resource. Because you can always get more of it. From them. Eesh. Well, when we come back, folks, I won't be dying as much. Or at all, hopefully. And I'll keep looking for eggs and getting my jungle things and exploring the area. And not having a front door made of wood. Perhaps a front door made of iron would be more sufficient. I'll catch you then, folks. See you then.